from time to time you might experience a slow drain um, soap and the hair gets into the drain system especially dew bends at uh, tubs and vanity basins and they clog it up and often they're just ignored you you live with the problem I find it a lot in home inspections I go into a house and there it is a block drain and it's nothing more than needing a clean and it's very easy to do here's a product it's called Zep you can get this product, you can get similar products, it's not the only one, but this one I use because I found it's good. You get this product and you pour it down the drain. And what you need to do is you need a little cup, uh, this holds 8 ounces of fluid, and your cleaner, and then you go to your drain and you clean it. So let's go and do that, because I have a drain that needs cleaning, and you'll see what I'm doing, how you can do it very simply yourself. Now we're now in the bathroom with the slow drain, it's actually the tub, and we'll just run water into the tub, and you'll see that we'll, we'll start to fill up the tub. So instead of running clear and free, it's actually starting to, to build up. So what we're going to do, is we're going to go and take our, um, our cleaner, our ZEP cleaner, and put that into our measure so that we've got our true 8 ounces and then we'll pour it into the So we're going to measure out 8 ounces in our cup. I use a disposable cup because after I've used this chemical I'm going to throw this cup away. I'll just pour in my 8 ounces. There we go, it's about right. And then very simply pour this down your drain. Once you've poured that down the drain, you want to actually add about 16 ounces of warm water. So we'll turn on the warm water, we fill it up to there, that's 8 ounces. Put that down. and another eight ounces and that's it we're going to leave that now for about six hours and after that it should the drain will run freely well we're back at the bathtub about three hours after we put the chemicals down and you can see the water is running freely into the uh, drain now just turn this off and you'll see it's draining quite quickly Whereas before it was quite slow. So that took three hours and probably cost us no more than a couple of dollars at most uh, for the chemicals that we put down the drain. And remember, if you do this regularly, say once a month, you're going to reduce the costs even further because you won't end up needing to have a plumber. And we all know how expensive they can be.